All right, so we're gonna be going over how to um, emulate Nintendo DS games on your uh, jailbroken um, Nintendo Switch. So you wanna be booted into your, uh, your custom firmware and uh, you wanna launch um, you want to launch into the 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 homebrew um, menu, and uh, to do this, uh, we're going to make sure that we're not in applet mode. So pick any software, hold the right bumper, oh that's not going to work, uh, start software. Okay, there we go. Go to the um, Homebrew App Store, and we're gonna we're gonna search for we're going to search for Melon DS, right? So Melon, there it is, right there. Go ahead and download and let that install, and then go back and then quit out of this. Go back to your Homebrew menu. And what we're going to do is we need to put the uh, firmware that's required to run DS games onto your uh, micro SD card. Um, the easiest way, uh, without having to turn it off, take out the micro SD, and then re-inject the payload, honestly, just go back to boot into your Atmosphere um, payload, reboot to payload, um, press minus, that'll boot you back into Hakate. And um, yeah, I know the background is different. Um, I followed, shout out to IDX3. <laughs> I forgot that I had his background on. Um, so we're going to go to tools and we're going to go to USB tools and we're gonna go to SD card. It's gonna wait for a connection. Now you need your USB-C cable that's plugged into that, uh, is plugged into your um, computer. So go uh, on your computer, you should see your switch files come up. It'll be named something. Uh, uh, it'll be named something. Now, what we need to do is we need to go to. Um, you need to go into your uh, the switch folder and then find Melon DS. There should be a Melon DS folder. And uh, put this off to the side. Now you're going to go to this uh, wiki here. I'll have this linked in the description. This is going to contain uh, our files that we need for the Nintendo DS. Um, right. So scroll down to the Nintendo DS slash DSI section, and you're going to want to download DS BIOS, DS BIOS files and firmware. Uh, you know, for uh, Melon DS, right? When you download it. Um, Extract it, and all you need to put into this folder is bios7.bin, bios9.bin, and firmware.bin. That's the only things that you need to put in this folder. Okay, now for your ROMs. Um, I usually like to, to organize this by having a folder called NDS Games or, Nintendo, or DS Games, whatever. And make sure that when you put your ROMs in here, they are in uh, .nds format, right? So go ahead and put your games in there. When you're done, go ahead and, and safely eject your micro SD. Here it should say ejected. If it does, great. Press close. Close this. Go back to home. And we're going to launch back into our, our custom firmware. Once it boots back up, um, you can actually go ahead and disconnect your uh, USB. And now we're going to make sure to uh, go to the go to the homebrew menu, uh, um, not in applet mode, so that it has uh, so that you're using the full capacity of the Switch's RAM to play your games. So let's go ahead and do that. Scroll over to Melon DS. Press A. Now in here, uh, before you launch your game, go to emulation settings and make sure that the switch CPU clock 
is set to 1785 uh, megahertz. This ensures for so that your gameplay isn't choppy and slow. Um, here's the rest of my settings in case you want to know, in case you have any other problems, right? Let's go back and let's uh, boot up New Super Mario Bros. I'm going to press A. And here it is, right? So if you want to change any settings on here, what you can do is hold the right and left buttons. Sorry, the uh, hold the right and left uh, ZL and ZR. This will allow you to change settings here. You can go to display settings. You can change the way that the screen looks, right? So you can emphasize, um, yeah, emphasize top or bottom or have it split side to side. Uh, you can you can mess around with a lot of that. Uh, you can also uh, save and load states uh, at any point during the emulation. So um, yeah, there you go.